I don't know about you, but I just hate wasting stuff. So what do I do with it? Well, let's jump into this together and I'll explain. Welcome to this episode of DIY3DTech.com. In this episode, I want to share with you guys what I do with my scraps. Kind of long story short, I ended up with this little extra piece of uh, 2040 rail. And I just hate wasting things. And it's not that I'm a tree hugger or anything like that, but again, I just hate seeing good things go to waste. So I had this piece from another project left over, and I was thinking, what could I do with it? And then it hit me. I can design this. What is this, you ask? Well, it's kind of an ultra-modern industrial type stand that I designed up in Fusion 360 to use this piece. So one of the things, if you look back, I created this um, kind of uh, modern phone stand that slides underneath the keyboard and allows me to set my phone and phone charger. I have a wireless phone charger on it because I do conference calls all day long for work. And I thought, you know, this would be kind of cool to do up a new modern industrial looking one and integrate this piece as sort of a piece of working art. So that's exactly what I did. So I designed up this one piece and I just simply printed it twice. Kind of a long story short, this piece slides in here like this. And actually it's tight enough to fit that it won't come out. But I thought it would be add to the industrial look if I also added some... Um, hex screws which you can tighten up here. I'm not going to waste your time tightening these but I just want to show you how this looks. And so again this slides on here and again it's pretty tight and then boom Bob's your uncle. Now it sits on the sit on the desk like this. I'll put some little feet on the bottom here and uh, the phone and charger will sit on the top here and I actually designed this to be the size of the charger. Now, for some reason, I used some cheap Chinese filament. I got it for about 14 bucks a roll, and I got some weird texturing here, but it doesn't matter. This is going to be covered with the phone charger, and the phone charger is this exact size, so it'll look pretty cool all together. And then I'll just simply tighten down these hex bolts. So the big reason I share this with you in this Design Talk episode is when you end up with some extra pieces like this, kind of think um, industrial art maybe, but integrating it into a useful product comes out really handy, plus it looks kind of cool if you ask me. I'll throw this out on Thingiverse, so if you've got some extra 2040 laying around, it's a neat, easy project to do. So anyways, hopefully you found this interesting. If you did, hey... Swag Shop's going to be up there. Subscribe over there. Let me know in the comments below what kind of ideas you would have for some extra 2020 or 2040. I got a bunch of this stuff laying around. I use it like crazy, and I save the extra pieces to do things just like this. Cheers, and we'll catch you in the next video. Please click like below and subscribe to the channel.